hello guys welcome back to show tips in this video i'm going to talk about how to fix icloud backup failed on iphone or ipad and how to fix this up so first thing what you have to do is when you are having this issue first thing is you have to check your icloud storage you have to check your icloud storage so to do this you just have to go to you have to tap on settings from here you have to go to you have to click on apple id then from here you have to click on icloud over here then from here you have to check for the storage available as of here as you can see that this is my storage available right now so this is the first step what you have to do and if you are having a little amount of storage or short of storage then what you have to do is you just have to tap here on the manage storage and you have to do the further designs right then you have to make sure that you are having enough amount of storage so next thing is all about the next fix when it comes to fix the issue is check your wi-fi connectivity which is very important so that sometimes you know due to the wi-fi issues connectivity will be having these kind of issues so make sure that you are connected to a wi-fi which is having all things are good i mean it is all good and having good connection the routers are not uh, all good and it is uh, not having any kind of errors so make sure that the wi-fi connection is all good right so this is what you have to do when it comes to second one so next one is moving on to next one is all about reducing the icloud backup size all right this is what i just mentioned above to do this you just have to go to settings then you have to click over here at the top you have to click here at the top then you just have to click on icloud you have to click on icloud and you have to click on manage storage you have to click on manage storage and from here you have to check yourself that what do you have to do and you have to go for it and change storage plan when you click on this change storage plan so you have to see this storage plan and we are having the options where you can set it up for example 5 gb is absolutely free but even you can go for 15 gb or 200 gb and even 2 tb so where you have to pay for it so you have to check yourself according to your needs you have to change this which is very important and this is what you have to do so next one is free up some of the icloud storage space which i mentioned all together so you can free up the space if you wanted to for example as you can see that all around 3.9 is being completely taken by this so when i can delete this right so this is what i can do so according to your needs you have to check yourself that which all things are mandatory for you guys to keep on the icloud so you can go for it or else if you unwanted things you can completely remove it so this is what you have to do and the moving on to the last one of the solution which means kick what you have to do is you just have to go to general and you have to go for software update and you have to check any kind of software updates are available so if any kind of software updates are available just go for the software update as you can see that i have successfully updated to the last time i was updated to ios 14.3 and now the public beta is available so where i'll definitely have a look on to it and i'll be doing a review on that so these are some of the possible workarounds which you can try when you're having ios backup failed on iphone or ipad and this is how you can fix this up so if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification and this is shahin officially signing off i'm good tips keep practice social distance be safe and stay safe